what's up y'all so this is going to be a quick video because i noticed something last night that just had me almost completely flabbergasted um so this week i've been in the thinkorswim um platform training with td ameritrade and you know i joined it because i thought that um it was going to be a little advanced so i've been using thinkorswim for you know four years or so um, so I'm pretty familiar and comfortable with the platform itself. Um, so I took, I registered for this class because I thought that uh, it was going to be more than what I expected. I mean, don't get me wrong, I learned some things for sure. Um, I don't regret signing up for it. But for me, I definitely need a an advanced walkthrough of the platform um, just to see what else I can take advantage of. But anyway, that's not the purpose of this video. So last night, um, I'm in the training and we're going through some settings or whatever. And I'm trying to figure out at the time how to um, extend my uh, my charts right into the future. As you can see, there's space over here um, with no candlesticks because it, it's not it's not the future yet. Uh, it's not. 1125 is not 1130 so whatever so in that I'm just kind of clicking through the settings and I noticed that thinkorswim my thinkorswim had been defaulted to delayed quotes um and what I mean is I don't mean up up here where it says real-time data tells you what your data is I don't mean that <laughs> I mean the actual price quotes that you get so what I've noticed a lot lately is that my um, the contracts the premium on the contracts aren't updating quick at all or they hadn't been updating quickly at all so uh, and even the, sh the the prices of the underlying so the price of the tickers the stock it, it just it there was there seemed to be a delay of some sorts so naturally this impacts my trading because I don't know what the actual price on any given thing is at the time that I'm trying to enter so all I have the only choice that I have is to go with what I see um, so here's what I noticed so I went to set up application settings right under general if you go to system it tells you what your quote speed is mine was defaulted to moderate so max delay was three seconds so my basically my thinkorswim platform was delaying my quotes by a maximum of three seconds that's a problem especially especially when the markets have been so volatile and VIX has been spiking lately. That's a problem. So last night, I'm flabbergasted looking at this. And so I'm like, well, let me change mine to real time, no delay. Um, apply settings and there have been no issues. Like I've noticed a big, big, big difference in how the prices are moving on, on the stock on my watch list. And on the premium of the option contract so yesterday and previous days before the prices weren't updating this fast in real time so that's it you know so make sure you guys go into settings or set up application settings and look under general and go to system and just see what your quote speed is some of y'all, you know, may already have real time, but I know mine was de defaulted to moderate, so it was slightly delayed. So make sure you um, update your quote speed to real time. Thank you for watching.